As a member of the AFT Executive Council, we recently adopted a process that we wanted to give all of our members an opportunity to speak to the candidate. What pulls me into this race is this basic notion of opportunity. What kind of an America we are. She gets it, she understands the struggles that we are going through. And to hear that she doesn't forget about that makes me even like her that much more. I'm here because, actually teaching because of my father's union. And I'm here because of my grandfather's union. As President of the United States, we will strengthen the hand of unions. Unions built America's middle class. Unions will rebuild America's middle class. But I see in her that there is a possibility as, as, a, as a changer, a game changer. The same number of people who graduate from Community College of Philadelphia, the same number, um, default on student loan debt. So here it is, holding back our economy, making it tough on an entire generation. So here's how I put this together. For 95%, that is 43 million Americans, this is cancellation of up to $50,000 of student loan debt. Her proposal would absolutely address the default crisis. We do have members who have, you know, $7,500,000 worth of student loan debt. I will name, as President of the United States, a Secretary of Education who has been a public school teacher. I want someone who has seen tattered textbooks or tried to manage when there are too many kids in a classroom. We need to exercise the muscles of voting, yep. the muscles of being engaged, and the muscles of believing. I feel like uh, unions have a lot of political power and I feel really lucky to be part of a union that democratizes that power and lets us come and have our voices heard. For me, it made me feel much more connected to my union. It helps to bring in the young, young members and really kind of see that the political process is, you know, it, it's for everybody in the union and everybody needs to be connected to it. So honestly, I would have never thought that I would be this close to a candidate for President of the United States. And I'm glad the AFT provided us this opportunity so we can hear firsthand about the issues that are facing us.